Hello YouTube friends, Alicia here with a video of a junk journal. This is a junk journal that I'm making for um, a little girl. And she's, well, not really little, but she's 14 and she's moving to Bolivia on Tuesday. And she has seen some of my journals and I had asked if I would make her one. Um, and of course, you know, I did. Um, it was kind of hard because it's like a, like a goodbye gift. I, I spent a lot of time with her. Um, but anyways, yeah, she's moving to Bolivia on Tuesday. That's where she's from. So she's going home. And um, this is the journal I have created. And if you've watched my videos, you know I've created another journal using um, a monochrome kit by Tsunami Rose. And so I used the same kit. This cover image is not from Tsunami Rose. It's actually um, colored, but I uh, printed it in black and white. And I just added it to the cover. Um, I actually kind of regret that just because, uh, the images are very pretty in color, but I'm, I don't know, I don't really, yeah, I'm not really sure that I would put it on a cover of black and white again, let's just put it that way, but, um, the images are beautiful. I'm not sure where they're from, they're, like, it's an Etsy purchase, they're not free. Anyways, and this is a flower that I've made a couple of years ago, and had in my stash, Brad in the middle, some Butterbee scraps metal, and then I put brads through this and an eyelet, and then I've just tied ribbon, black ribbon, some Chinese braid. Well, I don't know if that's actual Chinese braid, but and then it's easy twine binding, and I used I don't know why it's not focusing, um, rosettes. Are you gonna focus? There we go, and in the middle, there's some. Um, hmm, what's the word? Like gems or whatever? They're not sticky back, but... Okay, well my camera's not focusing. Um, and then on the corners, or on the edges, I cut a piece of metal from Butterbee Scraps in half and did that so that it wouldn't wear on the book. Uh, the back is just plain. It's... It's like corrugated paper almost, like the texture, but it's just paper that I picked up from my thrift store. And it has texture, so it feels really neat. Um, I added my lace on, not all, but on some of the pages. And I added ephemera. This is another free printable. It's not Tsunami Rose just a dress tag I've made. She wanted, originally she wasn't gonna use it for writing because she doesn't write very much. However, um, she said she might end up using it for writing. So I kept it fairly flat because um, this is some music paper with some gold lace, gold and white lace. Uh, I was thinking I could make it chunky with embellishments, but I didn't want to do that in case she decided to write. This is um, stamped ephemera that I've made. These are tickets that I painted white and then they're embossed, stamped and embossed. You can tuck under here as well. Like it won't hold anything, but I mean, if you want to put a picture under it, it's, it still would work like if you're going to glue the picture down. Okay, I'm not in frame. It's plain like most of my journals. More pockets. Graph paper. Another dress that I just cut out and printed. These are more free printables. And they're tags. They're not backed. Um, I kind of ran out of time. It's quite late here. I worked a lot this week and so... It should have been done already, and if it was done sooner, it would have been um, much more decorated. This is another free printable, and I just made it into the center of the signature. These are also free printables. These are backed on graph paper. This is part of the ephemera, the dresses. 
this opens up and there's journaling cards inside that come with the kit. It's a really fun kit to work with because um, based on the fact that it's like black and gray, you can add any other color and it's not going to clash. And so you can glue your pages together apparently. Um, you can do whatever you want with the kit. Oh, and the music pages are all pockets. And this is going on the plane with her, so I mean, anything she picks up along the way, I know she has a layover, um, she can just add in or write. Uh, these are some Gears die cuts. She loves, like, steampunk stuff, so I... I did that just for fun for her. She also asked me if I would add this tag that I had made. So I added that and there's a gear on top and this is gold embossed. There's actually another tag she wants me to add. I can see if I can find it. She saw it here and she asked me if I'd add it. These are more of these tags. Some more gears. I'm thinking tomorrow I will embellish it a little bit more. I'll show you at the end. I have tons more things um, that I had printed out for the journal. Some of it I'll just include with the journal um, for her to add. But this is another pocket and there is ephemera inside. This is from the kit. This is a pocket from the kit and a tag. It's very similar to my other journal. Uh, there's not as much lace. This is another um, tuck spot. Another pocket. The center of the signature. This is an envelope. Comes with the kit and journaling cards. I'm hoping the easy twine binding does hold up, but I'm thinking it should be fine because the pages were mostly the same size and I mean it is secure um, it pulls a little bit but uh, it's secure in the envelope and then because I did add stuff to the spine so oh I need to cut that I guess but so I'm hoping that it, that works out okay another ticket that I altered This is tag I made. Beautiful mess. That's from the kit. Um, more tags, free printables. Another tag from the kit and some lace pockets. Just some gears. These are backed on graph paper again. Oh, um, these are not actually black and white um, at the download. I printed them black and white for the journal. And same with the other tags. They're not black and white. I, I do that on my printer. And then I'll just show you really quickly. There's tons of ephemera that I have printed off and don't have in. Um, these are just notebook paper that I'm going to cut down for her as journaling spot. And then that's from the kit. That's from the kit. Um, that's the same page. That one's from the kit. These are free printables that I have. Like I said, she likes steampunk, so I figured I'd add the clocks and such. So that is 
everything. Sorry that it's not the greatest video. Um, but I want to get a video before I had sent it away with her. Um, thank you for watching. Any questions, leave them below.